a lot of people asked me to talk about politics and here we go with my first video about politics I mean I had uh, videos about politics before but not in this channel and maybe not in this social media so after leaving Algeria I have been living in Russia for more than 12 years and with the recent events I learned a lot about Russian politics so one of the things that I learned about is the Soviet Union and there are people who consider that the Soviet Union still exists till now and they have many arguments about that some arguments are related with the document signed but there is a very interesting argument that I want to share with you because I considered it the most truthful but I am still not sure about that that's why I wrote that disclaimer don't trust all the information said here but do your own research so let me jump to the argument so the argument related to the central bank of Russia it suppose that Russia has the currency ruble and one ruble costs about zero 0.06 dollar or something like that but for some reason in the website of the central bank of russia they still share the rates of the soviet ruble and that's really a strange thing some people they say that uh, it's used for international exchanges and not the internal exchanges but the strange thing that the soviet ruble worth more than the dollar American dollar of course and let me show you what I am talking about so let's go to Google and write there the Central Bank of Russia let's go to the website then go to uh, these three lines and click database in database we go to foreign currency market then we go to the official exchange rate set in this month I, I mean in 2010 and you see the magic here so in the bottom you see 100 USD equal like about uh, 58 ruble that means like one ruble cost almost kind of uh, two dollars like one dollar and point seven it's really crazy and here you see like the ghost bank of the USSR official rates exchange rates I mean and it's the November 2022 like the first November like the, the previous month it's really crazy what does it mean I mean the Soviet Union still exists the Soviet ruble still exists I don't really get it look at that so let's check for example like the Australian dollar like 37 100 Australian ro dollar is 37 I mean uh, it looks like that the Soviet ruble is more expensive than the Australian dollar and then others and here US dollar for example 100 dollar we have equal 58 ruble that means one Soviet ruble equal 100 divided by 58 so it's about 1.7 that means the ruble is more expensive than the dollar it's really strange so let's count it here let's take the number of 100 dollar that cost 58 rubles divided and we find 1.7 that means one soviet ruble is more expensive than the dollar and it's not like 0 0.06 let's check the like the simple ruble that is used inside of Russia and let's check it let's write here in Google ruble like VS dollar or ruble dollar and it will give us like no 0, 0 0.01 like not 0 0.06 but 0 0.01 like one 
Russian ruble that is used now among all people. And if we use $100, that means 6,000 rubles, not 58. So what is this Soviet ruble and what is the difference between the Soviet ruble and the simple ruble? I don't really know. It's really a mystery. So is that mean that the Soviet Union still exists? Is that mean that Russia doesn't exist and never existed ever? I don't really know. The more I learn about politics, the more I find strange things that very hard to explain. Tell me in the comments what do you think about this topic? Thank you for watching the video till the end. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, to like the video, to comment and see you in my next videos. Bye.